Kayla tells me she was just like any other student here at Yulee High School until she came down with the flu a few months ago. My life was dedicated to that because I enjoyed it so much. Kayla was set on playing softball in college until she was diagnosed with narcolepsy with cataplexy, a condition causing her to collapse without warning. Now I can't play softball and moving away would kind of be difficult now with everything that's happening. Kayla tells me she's still determined to have a normal college career. Her mother says that won't be possible without a service dog. She'll be standing there and then all of a sudden, bam, she's on the ground and she hits anything that that's in the way. Enter Maisie. <laughs> Come here. That's right, they already have the dog. All they're missing is the money to train the pup in recognizing and warning Kayla when she's about to collapse. It's a one to four year wait for one already trained and you, it could be from 15 to $30,000 to train her for a service dog. With the help of her friends and family, Kayla is well on her way to that goal, but she'll need the support of the community to ensure her independence. We'll have the link to Kayla's GoFundMe page on our website, actionnewsjacks.com. Coming up at 5, we'll tell you how much money has been raised. Beth Russo, CBS 47, Action News Jacks.